So Team STD, it's finally time to make a crew video right now. I know it's been so long and I know I really haven't talked about it at all. But you know what, I really felt that it's time to talk about it. It's really time to give my thoughts, my opinions on what's going to happen in 2K15 regarding crew mode. What I want to see, what I hope to see, and all that good stuff. Team STG, you know, leaving the video with you guys, letting me know what you guys want to see and what not. Alright, it's been a long time, but we got a nice discussion to do this for you guys. And I'm actually really, really excited. So, we do know that crew mode was insane in 2K11. Everybody played it. It was one of the best game modes ever. You know, it was crazy because you and a group of friends to play with each other and play against people it was like playing real life basketball but online but you had that virtual experience similarly to halo 3 man when you played and you still remember those people it was competitive it was awesome it, it was sick dude it was honestly crazy and kevin durant should make this open shot dude come on man but yo 2k15 is coming out very soon time waits for nobody this game is getting closer by the day and we still really don't know anything if crew mode is 100% coming back you know we've heard things that you know parks might be coming back and whatnot and if you look at the back of the cover if you look at the back of the cover for Kevin Durant, you can notice a park scene, if you will, a basketball court back. I don't know if that's resembling crew mode. I don't know if it's resembling an actual, you know, an actual park. But you know what? You know, the least it could tell you that they are bringing something back. So if you're the type of dude who's worried that they're not even going to bring back park, no. Park or crew mode is coming back for sure. One or the other. Both would be awesome. But at least we're going to get some type of experience where we get to play a 5 on 5 or a three on three, 100 percent that's going down. So that's the optimism right there for you guys, Team STG. That is the optimism you're getting. But are we going to be getting an official crew mode where you get to pick your own jerseys? You play in a stadium, you play against people, you got official refs and whatnot. That's something I honestly don't know about yet. That's something I honestly don't know about yet. But I honestly feel like we should be able to have that feature. Why? Because this PS4 and Xbox One is capable of, you know, so many things, man. It just has such an amount of memory. And, you know, it's not like we have 30 games for the PS4. We have so many gigabytes on our PS4. I'm sure that the, I'm sure they can just double it and give us crew mode. I think that would be awesome. I think that would be awesome. We, 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 we don't mind the extra memory. Let's be real. We don't mind the extra memory. But I do know that a lot of people really do like Park. A lot of people like Park. So I do want them to bring it back. Because a lot of people are loving that off, co off the court. You know, you do crazy moves. You do crazy passes and crazy dunks and stuff. It's like it's kind of like playing NBA Street. But on a 2K version. A little bit more mature version. And, you know, I give 2K props for doing that. And enabling us to do that. Because it's a lot of fun. Let's be real. But then, of course, there's times when we actually want to play as a team in a more competitive, serious tone. A more competitive, serious tone is what we want to play with jerseys. With You know, we want to play that old, old-style crew mode. We all want it back. So what I'm suggesting is maybe they can have it where we can play both. Where we can have a competitive crew mode and then a non-competitive crew mode. Similarly to Halo 3 where we had our social playlist and then we had the rank playlist. The social playlist is you played games that didn't count as ranking. You could just chill. doesn't matter if you win or lose. You still get XP and whatnot. And the rank playlist, that's when you level up. That's when you have to win. That's when games are competitive and whatnot. And maybe the rank playlist for 2K15 could possibly be the straight up crew mode that we are used to. The one that we want back. And then, of course, the social, the non-competitive, could be a simple park gameplay. So you get the best of both worlds. Now, this is going to be a brand new game. And, of course, the servers, in my opinion, are going to be better. 2K definitely knows from their mistakes. And they learn from their mistakes. And they really are going to try implementing. It's not like they're doing nothing. They're working on a brand new game. And parks and crew mode and all that stuff definitely is a big part of the game. They know that. They know a lot of people like to play parks. If you go on parks, there's a lot of people playing. There's a lot of people playing. It's not like Parks is gone and Parks is irrelevant in 2K. No, Parks is still a big part of 2K. Look at Durant getting that dunk. So Team STG, this is what I'm trying to say. They're working on this and they know we want crew mode. If you guys watched the live stream last week, you know that everybody was talking about crew. Everybody wanted crew back and everybody was addressing it. Everybody was addressing it. There's, they know that. It's not like they, you know, maybe they don't reply to it, you know, directly, but they see it, they acknowledge it, and they obviously know they're going to be making changes. So I have no idea yet if they're, you know, bringing back the old straight up crew mode, but I do know if Parks is coming back. I'm not sure, but if Parks is coming back, which most likely it will, if crew doesn't. They are going to enhance it. It's going to be different. It's not going to be the same parks. They're not just going to bring back the same exact parks. There's going to be enhancement made. You know, my guess is maybe 
if there is no crew, Parks comes back. But you do get to customize your jerseys, you get to customize your team name, you actually get to get a team, and you get to have like crews, if you will, if you remember that from 2K Current Gen. So, you know, Team STG, I honestly don't know what to expect. They are being really low key, if you guys know. We really don't know much about 2K15 yet. You know, me too. I really don't know anything. I, I, we really don't know much. We know that Pharrell's, you know, be you know, handling the music and we'll be talking about that next video. But a lot of this is just predictions and whatnot. But I really want to hear from you guys. What do you guys want to see in crew mode? Do you prefer crew mode or do you want parks? Do you want both? What's your perfect crew mode? What's your perfect parks? If they're not going to bring back crew mode and they're only going to stay with parks, what enhancements and changes do you want done in parks? Let me know, Team STG. I hope you guys enjoyed this, this discussion. I really want to talk about this because I know a lot of you guys wanted me to do so, and I really want to hear your comments. Hope you guys enjoyed. Peace.